hi guys hope you are doing great and welcome back to the second video of i hope that you enjoyed the last time video and you have taken into consideration the most important uh, points that you need to know so as of course to start your online business and that's very cool and very amazing so today's video guys we can of course sign up to shopify and of course start of course learning much more about uh, shopify uh, uh, creation and so on and so forth we can start of course uh, our 14 free trial and of course later on you can upgrade guys i'm not here selling guys any membership so i'm gonna show you now how you can just sign up yourself and uh, of course it's quite very easy but before this guys if you like what i am doing here for you guys if you like the content of course they am providing because it takes from me much more time of course to provide you with this information so the only thing that i need from you is to subscribe and hit the button to receive a notification of course whenever i upload a new video or update and also it will be nice of you if you share with your friends or whomever is interested to learn much more about dropshipping so let's make it guys together okay as you know sharing is curing okay so now guys the only thing that you have to do of course is to come only to shopify.com okay you just need to type of course if you go to google just you need just of course to type shopify.com and you will be here okay then the only thing that you have to do is to submit your email okay you will receive uh, an email so as to act from of course shopify so as to, active, to activate your account so i'm sure that you will be around here exactly in this dashboard uh, i will totally agree that it will be a little bit different from uh, i mean my dashboard will be a little different from other other people's that live in some other countries some like united states canada switzerland because it depends on location where you are living in for example for some countries you will find some more stuff here okay but that's totally fine guys so once you are here of course in your dashboard here where you can see everything about how you can manage your store in your lift here you can find everything that you need to do so of course here where you can add your products for example customize team add a domain for example you will find of course some more tutorials here that can help you of course if you need much more information okay uh, and when it comes to your lift here guys as I have mentioned before here where you can find everything about your store creation when it comes to orders for example so I will take you through this step by step so as to understand everything okay uh, when it comes to order here where you can manage of course your orders and it's uh, we will do that later on guys and it's quite very easy uh, here where you can see all the orders that you have i mean all the products that you have uh, sold for example when it comes to abandoned checkout well, here where you can see for example when a, a customer come to your uh, store for example and put an item in their cart but they don't check out okay so you can of course uh, you can see that in your store and you can know exactly what customer who does so so you can contact them back again so as to get to get them back of course to buy your product if they are interested okay when it comes to products guys uh, here where you can manage everything about your product you can add your products and so on and so forth we will do that later on guys so you don't have to worry okay about inventory for example here where you can uh, track your inventory uh, if this is the first time you heard about inventory guys here where you can manage of course how many products that you should have in your store or at your stock for example okay from it comes to collections if you want to create your collection you can just uh, click on create collection so collections uh, makes it very easy for your customer 
so as to go directly to specific product okay when it comes to gift cards guys it's totally quite very easy you can add them or it depends of course on you uh, if you want to sell gift cards for example you can of course add them to Shopify as well but if you want to send gift cards whenever someone buy from you some some certain product it will be very awesome to do so okay when it comes to customers here where you can manage customer details uh, here where you can find everything about your customer his uh, address here is in his email or his phone number for example okay about analytics it's totally it's totally very obvious and clear here where you can find everything about your your uh, your store analytics total sales for example online store sessions returning customer rates for example uh, when it comes to leave view guys here where you can see okay here where you can see of course everything if you are if you have for example a store now and you are selling products you have created a campaign on Facebook or on Google Ads or something like that and you are generating some sales for example here where you can see you leave I mean you leave you about what is going on okay which is very amazing when it comes to marketing I believe that uh, Shopify of course provide you here with all the marketing tools that you need for example so as to manage your store and to promote it okay as you see here there are some marketing apps you can use this of course apps so as to make your store quite very beautiful and attractive and of course you can manage it well okay and of course you can find here some of course some blogs or some uh, tutorials that you need to take into consideration if you have some time and it's very very useful okay when it comes of course to discounts I will later on guys of course show you how you can do uh, cap and codes because it's very important to have them in your store because it makes it makes a huge difference when, of course as you know people are looking for discount so it's very 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 awesome and very important to add uh, cap and codes okay so I will show you later on how you can add them when it comes of course to apps so when you of course install a certain app here where you can find it okay so of course guys if you want to check about uh, other for example Shopify app you just need to click or visit the Shopify app store here okay here where you can find all the app that you need for your e-commerce store for example you can type down here whatever app that you are looking for and you will find it here exactly as you see here so there are many 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 useful apps that we can use later on guys but you don't have to worry now about this because later on I'm again of course uh, talk a little bit about each I mean each app that I find it very useful and you can use it to to your store okay which is very very amazing and when it comes to online store guys here where you can see everything about your store when it comes to the to design teams for example navigation and so on and so forth as you see your current team this is our current team here as you see if we click on view for example we will see our current i mean our current team this is our team and of course we will change all this stuff later on we will need to add much more things and we will learn how we can of course use free teams or pay teams so if you scroll down a little bit here you will find of course free teams and pay teams so once you choose or select a certain team you need to customize it of course if you want to check much more teams you just need to visit team store for example and here where you can find all the teams that Shopify has 
I mean free ones and paid ones too, okay? If you scroll down, of course, you're gonna see multiple, uh, multiple, of course, teams here, okay? Of course, we're gonna talk about this later on as well, so, and we will discuss it, okay? And when it comes to blog posts, it's quite very simple. If you are good at SEO optimization, you can, of course, whatever you want. So as uh, people can find you on Google and on social media. About navigation, guys, here where you can, of course, manage your photo menu, main menu. Here where you can exactly help, for example, your your customers to navigate around your online store to go from this page to another page and so on and so forth okay when it comes to domains of course guys later on I will I will show you how you can add your domain name here it's quite very easy okay and about preferences it's very important to know some stuff here as well so here where you can find some information like for example a description about your store you can write a description here about your store your home page title and of course you can share your social media links on your store as well you can connect it to google analytics so as to see everything uh, on your google analytics you can of course connect uh, your store to facebook by using for, for of course Facebook pixel so you can it's quite very cool I will show you that later on as well so that's all guys about this video and see you of course in the next video bye bye